Japan is indeed one of the most beautiful countries in the world, filled with a mix of everything, from the hustle and bustle of Tokyo down to the laid-back Okinawa. It's a timeless country respecting the past whilst leading the way with advanced technology. While you may find Japan exceedingly modern, you will find vast opportunities to connect with their fascinating traditional culture. From exploring Japan's rich culinary scene to wandering through the majestic temples, you will never run out of things to do when visiting the beautiful country. Today, we present you the ultimate guide to visiting Japan. Don't forget to subscribe and let's head into it. Learn Japanese Learn Japanese, especially the phrase, do you speak English, for better communication. People in major tourist attractions or public transportation areas are where you can find help in answering your queries. Traditional culture On the surface, Japan appears exceedingly modern, but traveling around it offers numerous opportunities to connect with the country's traditional culture. Spend the night in a ryokan, a traditional Japanese inn, sleeping on futons and tatami mats, and padding through well-worn wooden halls to the bathhouse. Meditate with monks or learn how to whisk bitter matcha into a froth. From the splendor of a Kyoto geisha dance to the spare beauty of a Zen rock garden, Japan has the power to enthrall even the most jaded traveler. When should you visit Japan? If you're considering a trip to Japan, you're probably wondering what time of year is best to visit. The wonderful thing is every season is a great time to visit Japan and you will have a completely unique experience. In short, there is truly no bad time to visit Japan. Each season boasts different highlights such as the cherry blossoms blooming in the springtime, Mount Fuji opens for climbing in the summer, the leaves changing color in the fall, and of course, ski season in the winter. Food Wherever you are in Japan, it seems, you are never far from a great meal. Restaurants often specialize in just one dish, perhaps having spent generations perfecting it and pay close attention to every stage, from sourcing the freshest local ingredients to assembling the dish attractively. And as you'll quickly discover, Japanese cuisine has great regional variations. The hearty hot pots of the mountains are, for example, dramatically different from the delicate sushi for which the coast is famous. It's also intensely seasonal, meaning you can visit at a different time of year and experience totally new tastes. How safe is Japan? Japan is overall very safe and crime is low. But although theft isn't common in Japanese culture, that doesn't mean it can't happen to you. As with any place in the world, always be aware of your surroundings and use common sense. And we always recommend getting travel insurance to make sure you're covered in case anything gets stolen or you run into other emergencies. Outdoors Japan is a long and slender, highly volcanic archipelago. It's over two-thirds mountains with bubbling hot springs at every turn. In the warmer months, there is excellent hiking through cedar groves and fields of wildflowers up to soaring peaks and ancient shrines. In the winter, this is covered with snow and the skiing is world-class. Meanwhile, in the southern reaches, there are tropical beaches for sunning, snorkeling and diving. Ease of travel Japan is incredibly easy to get around. You can do a whole trip using nothing but its immaculate, efficient public transport. The Shinkansen bullet train network now runs all the way from the southern tip of Kyushu up to Hokkaido, and reasonably priced rail passes make it affordable. Major cities have subway networks that are signposted in English, and these days we're seeing and hearing more English all over. But if getting off the beaten track and outside your comfort zone is what you're after, you can have that experience too. Are credit cards accepted in Japan? Yes, but hold up. Major credit cards will typically be accepted at big hotel chains, nice restaurants, or shops in large cities. But you'll want to have cash on hand to use in small restaurants, markets, and in more rural towns. There are still many places where credit cards are not accepted, so it's a good idea not to rely on your plastic alone. Must-dos in Japan Cherry Blossoms of Tokyo one of the most popular sights are the cherry blossoms that bloom during the spring. These soft pink petals are an icon of Japan, with their blooming being one of the most awaited times of years for tourists and locals alike. Once these perfect pink blooms appear, you will find many indulging in hanami, which translates to looking at flowers. 
Nishiki Market in Kyoto. If you're looking for an absolute feast in Kyoto, then look no further. The Nishiki Market is a 400-year-old local food market with a smorgasbord of delicious eats that range from national food traditions down to modern fusions from all over the world. The market is also known as Kyoto's Kitchen because you can find top chefs and home cooks visiting to find local ingredients and culinary items. It's a feast where you can try free samples or spend merely a few hundred yen to get your taste buds excited. You can even book a guided tour to get a lot more information and avoid overpaying for food or samples. If you enjoyed getting to know more about traveling to Japan, share this video with your friends and hit the like and subscribe button.